Damn, first sub five minute. I'm getting a little bit better. 450, nice. I gotta go take a shit though. That has the nightmare kill 25 times. We're doing Fazani's obviously because it's a lot quicker. Gonna do another 25 for 125 points. That's the Grandmaster combat task. Can't wake up. Don't know what it is, but happy to get it done. 449, new personal best at Fasani's. All right, I almost have 50 nightmare kills. We'll go back and do that later. I'm gonna go do some myth dragons while I watch some shit because I'm chilling, bro. I'm J chilling right now. Still impling. Finally, we get our elven signet, right? No, another crystal acorn. And that is defeat the nightmare 50 times. Obviously done just a bunch of Fasani's KC. I would do more kills, but I have a really big issue with concentration. And I either respond to my friend or type in a Twitch chat and end up dying. And it is just not worth the time. So I'm going to leave it for now. But yeah, that is 125 points. 61,180 points now. I'm about to go do Callisto. And because I never got my War Blessing, I can't actually use max strength best in slot gear. Because I need to replace something with a Bandos item. So I have the Bandos Bracers and the Bandos Stole. I'm trying to see which one's better. My melee strength with this is 110. Um, but my melee strength with this is 114. Okay, so it looks like I'm going to use the Ferocious Gloves. And he's the band of stone instead. Sorry if you can hear the cops in the background. Clearly they don't want to see me win. But yeah, this is what we're going to rock with. Only 114 strength, but it means we get to use four bandos items. Okay, we still need both the deep pick and the, what's it called? A ring, obviously, from Callisto. So I think a BGS into Scythe is just going to destroy here. Thralls as well, obviously, with Thrall damage. Basically just my, uh, this is basically just my nightmare setup. It can max like a 60, but obviously I have absolute unit on, so I'm thinking that's more like a 30. So maybe that's one I'll eat because I do have Knife's Edge on. Probably don't want to eat if I don't have to. Uh, might change out the Relics. Just want to see how it goes. I don't obviously have the special discount thing. So I can only really BGS a couple of times. So maybe we we'll want to bank one Knife's Edge for a special discount. And uh, I don't know. I'm not too sure. This kill seems to go pretty quick though. D-pick on our first ever kill count. Well, we've done one already. But no, Death Oh, we've done five in fact. Five Death Runes. Uh, 300 Death Runes, I mean. But yeah, we'll see how this goes. Maybe we'll change it out for a special discount. That's not great. I just lost my Infernal Max Cape. Hmm. Damn, I just lost my Infernal Cape full stop. I've gambled all of them. That's really not great. Damn, that's actually mad depressing. I guess we go do an Inferno right now. I guess we get to use the Twisted Bow, actually. Okay, a couple of messy waves, as the inventory says. One brew left only, but, um... It was part of the plan, so I could use the Sardome and Defense. Trust, guys. Trust. It was all part of the plan. Uh, honestly, shouldn't use too much food. Our Twisted Bow hits, like, 200s. I literally almost just one-hit that major, so... Probably shouldn't use too much food on Jad and Zox, so I think we should be good. But yeah, bit of a F, won't lie, bit of an F. That's one down. Oh, that one's already half HP after two hits. Come on, surely I out DPS the healers on one of these, bro. Okay, that's dead. Okay, so yeah, pretty much no food used on triples. I've only got a brew and a dose for Zuck, but... Hopefully that doesn't go too bad. Come on, surely I out DPS those healers. Never lucky, bro. Surely. 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 There we go. Alright, let's go do this suck. Get our cape back. I might, be able to want, I might be able to zero set this, actually, if I can hit it under uh, 600. Surely I do, right? Oh, what's that lag? What's that lag? Don't like that. Come on. Hit. Nah, I doubt. Unless I hit a big-ass number now. Damn it. Oh, wait. I did get it under. I just spawned Jad. Holy fuck. I was not expecting that. Can I kill Jad through the healers? Surely I can. Oh my god, I just fucking rinsed it. What's going on? Oh fuck, I think I actually just spawned healers. Yeah, I did. Oh my god. I was not expecting that.
All right, let's hit the zero set now. Surely we hit the zero set. Repot for the culture. Okay, we just zero said it suck. No luck required. Let's fucking go. 43 minute infernal cape. We take that. The titty bow do be hitting different. If I didn't waste time on the waves and brought chins, I'm very confident that I could shave quite a few minutes off this time. And I still have to do 14 more zucks for all the task completions. So I should have some fun speedrunning these. Guys, look at this. Almost 2 million views since the league started. The fact you guys are willing to watch my videos almost every single day means the absolute world to me. You guys have been killing it with the support too. So let's see how far we can go in these last three weeks. You guys know the drill. I've got a family of 104 people to feed. And the best way you can help by that is by finessing this YouTube algorithm to promote my videos. Each new subscriber I get per video is the number one best thing to promote me. So quickly double check that you are subbed. We just flew past 111k subscribers. So let's see what we can get up to after today. Okay, maybe it's actually not worth using special discount because I'm hopping for the kills. And uh, I don't get spec back if I hop, honestly. I gotta go do my farming contract. Someone in the Discord just reminded me. Let's go. We finally got the D2H. We've done a bunch of worldly bosses and we've only just got it, but that's 100 league points. 61,280 now, just like that. So, so happy. We're gonna camp here until we get the ring, though, because it's another 125 points. And we got another Dragon 2H now. Karma. And that is 50kc. I'm now officially a Callisto adept. Look at me go. Still hunting this uh, tyrannical ring or whatever it's called. Beg. I beg. Please, bro, Elven Signet, I beg. What did I just get? Oh, bro. I've opened like 60 of these guys, and all they give me is darts. All right, that's 100 KC. I'm not a Callisto veteran. Um, I think the drop rate's like 1 in 170. The kills are really quick, so I'm not really that stressed about it. Let's go. Right before my KFC is coming, too. That's actually perfect timing, because I can go AFK something now. Tyrannical ring. 125 points, 61,405 now. Very, very nice. 141 KC, so it's like, I think, 30 kills under the drop rate or so, so we take that. 52 KC is 1 in 82, but obviously that becomes a little bit lower. Oh, ho, 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 yo, last one, Dragon Full Hub. I was getting ready to talk like I wasn't going to get it, bro. Let's go. 61,530 points. Oh, that is so, so nice. Let's get that is so, so nice right there. Full Dragon set as well, 125 points. We just jumped up to 61,655 points. That's hilarious, man, 52 KC. I can have my KFC in peace now. 48 farming contract completion. Some might say I am the best to ever do it. I'm a bit more humble than that, so I wouldn't do it myself. Anyway, I'm gonna go do some CMs now. I think eight more and I get another 125 points. Obviously, there's still a bunch of uniques I can get for points, so it's still really good points per hour. So let's go do it. And nothing. And nothing. And nothing. I right, brush shit is actually turning around. Another per play. We got the door. Another 125 points right there. I think the bulwark actually does have a couple uses too, like in Maiden and in Nilo, maybe. Not sure what else. Maybe in even in Zuck, if I have the special discount relic, it might be useful in the Inferno. Not too sure yet, but that is 125 points, putting me at 61,780. Two more KC to go. The back to back, bro. Please just be a unique. That is huge, bro. Kodai. That is actually huge. That's another one of the master uh, mega rare tables or whatever. I do have to go do mage training arena, but that is 250 league points. That is huge, bro. That is So that Kodai is on the same drop table as the Tiddy Bow and the Elder Mall, which are all more rare than the rest of them. This is also 250 league points once I go do mage training arena. And the master one itself is 125 points. Uh, this is actually huge. It's like a big thing to have on a, a lot of the other competitors. But they will all be doing a bunch of challenge modes and a bunch of CMs anyway. And a lot of them, like Tom and a bunch of other people, already have the code I wanted, I'm pretty sure. So they've gone lucky too. But that is a very, very nice drop to get and secure somewhat early on. 50 CMs, 125 points. No back three back, unfortunately. That's also a master combat toss for uh, 50 CMs, which is very nice. Good place to stop. There is like another one, another Casey task at 100, I think. And then there's a master task at 200, which I doubt we'll get to. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Still a bunch of drops we can get, like Ancestral and shit like that. We'll come back here. Still need to get Augury too, now that I think of it. So yeah, 
125 points puts us up to 61,905, and we have 375 points waiting as soon as we get the Master Wand. I have no idea how long a Master Wand normally takes, but Mage Training Arena points are rece received are increased by 300% with this Frelic, so it will increase it by 3 times the speed. Still think it will take a while though, so let's get let's get buckled in. Okay, I'm gonna need 480 Telconnect points, 530 Alchemist points, 4,800 Enchantment points, and 480 Graveyard points. So this should be a lot of fun. Uh, let's get stuck in. Any Elven Signets? No, Crystal Shards. For the culture, for the culture, get an Elven Signet. For the culture, <laughs> more Crystal Shards. Surely it's time for an Elven Signet, right? Two Dragon Daggers. Okay, well, we'll keep trying and then we'll go back to Arena. Oh my god, Elven Signet, we got it! 125 points, just like that. Oh my god, that is so nice. That is so nice. I'm gonna get back to the Mage Training Arena for now, but I can now go back and, what's it called? I can just make that into Celestial Signet and soon for another 125 points. I just have a couple of stuff that I need to get for it. Finally, man. I've probably opened a fucking billion of those things. 62,000 points now. Over 62,000 points for the first time this league. We dropped all the way down to rank 9 or so during our top grind, and since we've gotten our drops and completed some tasks, I've flown all the way up to rank 4, with rank 3 within 200 points of me. And I have a Kodai Insignia waiting to spawn 375 points, and an Elven Insignia I can turn into a Celestial one for another 125 points. Tomorrow, we take rank 3. But for now, I go continue to be dry at Serachnus for my cudgel while I edit this video. You guys know the drill. Let's destroy this algorithm, get my videos out there, and feed my 142 children across the world. Right now, scroll down, subscribe to the channel if you're not. It's a win-win because it means you'll never miss a video either. And while you're down there, leave a like and a comment down below for some words of wisdom. I love you guys for doing this, each video, and for watching each video, and I will see you in the next one. Thank you guys once again for watching.